Hey, Orange One here, and we are with Redan the Merchant, and we've got enough money to buy our first caravan, so we're gonna do that. Um, so I wanted to do that, but I think there's also gonna be, yeah, there's this, we've got a ton of different quests here. Now, I think we're fine with just going ahead and buying a caravan. I'm gonna go, I don't know if it me makes a difference, but I'm gonna go with you because you're the most powerful merchant. Um, I'm not going to escort that caravan right now. I want to get these other quests uh, lined up and taken out before we do anything else. A little extra gold is good, but I don't want to leave town just yet. That being said, I am willing to have Blag go off and start a caravan. Now that we have to bear in mind means that we won't have Blag with us for fighting. So I think that means we have to go and give some better gear to our friend um, that we do have. So let's see, what do you have on you, Jin? I did end up actually getting you a better layered robe in between episodes as well. The scarf though, I would like to replace. Yeah, let's get you, um, one of those and we'll just sell the scarf to be honest it's not worth it um and you got a decent helmet your boots are okay too i don't think we can really buy you much more in terms of armor now we could give you some weapons though that is possible i was hoping to get a bow off of like a bandit but it doesn't seem like that's gonna be possible we could also just get you a better blade um, because that's a pretty crummy blade that you've got there, honestly. The weapon tier is only tier 2. And we could invest a fair amount in it and get you like a tier 4 weapon or something like that. A falchion. Yeah, I think that that's the best I, I'm willing to spend money on right now. Because we are a trader, we need to spend, save some money up for trading and stuff. Let's go ahead and... We're going to equip that to you, so you should use that. Sure, and that's going to make us pretty tight on money ourselves. I think that that's okay. Um, we're going to go ahead and let's start with you. Fencing stolen goods, sure, if we have the, the gold for it. Um, yeah, you got a problem. Oh. Wait, oh, did he say, what was it that he said? I need to heal up or something? Or did I not have enough cash? I think I didn't have enough cash, I think. He's like, yo, dude, you're broke. Has some gold to spend. <laughs> okay, well, I'll earn some gold then. Um, do I have anything that I can sell? I think I don't need a whole lot. I just need a little bit. So yeah, let's see. We'll, we'll just sell a couple dates. I, I don't think we need a whole lot, but I think that that should be good. I just want, I know that it's not ideal, but I just want the um, the resources to, to buy what he's, aw oh, man, really? Okay, even after selling those dates, it's not gonna do that for us. Just give me a second, I'll be right back. Okay, so let's see, we were, um, he won't let us accept that quest. The rival gang, Ryza. Yeah, we'll accept this because I don't think that this was the place that was bugged out. Yep. I'll, I'll fight them myself. I could leave someone behind, but I'll do it myself. Um, And what do you want? Raw materials. Can I... I, I might be able to get the this quest done and then use that money to get the other one. Uh, six units of iron ore. Okay, sure. I'll, I'll get you your iron ore, don't you worry. I'll go over to some city, get that iron ore, and bring it back. Um, I mean, he said 700 for it, so I might even be able to buy it in here. I've done that before. How many units did he need? 
Um, we can buy that for a whole lot cheaper. Like, the null is only 60. Let's see, how much did he, did he want? Um, I'm not seeing it underneath quests. Come on, Dwayne. Tell me what you need, I'll get it for you. Six units. Okay, well I could make like a profit of like 100 gold just off of doing that in town, but I think we probably want to go buy that from like another town over. Like Hub Yard, wasn't that one of the places that we could have gotten a decent deal on it? I'm not sure, but if it is, then we'll go do a quick trade run down there. Um, yeah, we can get a pretty good deal there. So let's take our 600 and we'll go sell some stuff at Hub Yard. And we don't have much, to be honest. I think we gotta go, just go down there, get that iron ore, and then come back, unfortunately. Let's go to Hub Yard. Um, that gang thing, we've got that quest activated. Kareed, what do you need? You wanted me to escort a merchant caravan. Tell you what, I'm gonna go do this. You might go to Hub Yard anyways, but I kind of want to make Dwayne have a better relation with, with us and so that we can get some recruits from him and then we'll also go back to the Potter and deal with him. I wonder if this means that there's a deserts, there's another desert hideout nearby because these guys are spawning around here. I think that is what that means, but I could also be wrong. Oh, we're going to lose some money from that caravan, it looks like, so we can't take out as much. 400 I think it said we could take out um, of course dates we can't sell here I'm excited to see how much money we end up making from the other thing though where's the iron ore I'm not seeing it at all huh very strange Yeah, it is a little bit concerning actually, seeing how we're kind of low on money. Can I take anything back to Ryza? I mean, I could do the clay, that's a little bit of money. Better than nothing. I think we're gonna need to bring the clay back. Yeah, we're gonna need to do that. Let's just load up on as much clay as it will let me. Um, yeah, we'll do like that. And then we're going to be pushing the limit there. How about the salt? salt? Does that sell decently here? No, it does not. Yeah, basically everything that we have does not sell well in this place. That's a shame. Um, we'll just go back. By the time that we're... We're done with all of this. Hopefully, oh, are we in the negatives? No, we're just gonna like, be in the negative the next day. Um, we could try and attack. Yeah, let's just attack these looters. That should get us a little cash, right? And it's not gonna be enough to keep us afloat, but it's something. And you know what? I don't even really want to do the combat because it's like, no, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm gonna actually have my guys do some fighting though. Infantry! Archers! Okay, archers, come Infantry! over Infantry! Archers! Forward! Archers, you should be up here. Get on the high position. I'm gonna actually let my guys do some fighting, and I'm just kinda gonna watch. Slash, give them a little bit of cover as needed. Yeah, those... That one archer dude, I think, is gonna... Yeah, the master archer. Sorry, master archer is gonna get some kills. Oh, we got some throwing spears as well. Yeah, you looters are not gonna even get to the line, I don't think, if you do. I'd be impressed. Oh, they hit, they're hitting my horse with some rocks. Yeah. <laughs> not even a risk. Good job, team. Got some good experience there. I mean, myself, we're not built for fighting, so it's kind of pointless to have us doing fighting ourselves. I'm just gonna kind of at this point 
build us towards being a merchant. And in the long run, I do want to have us be like a little general, like we'll be like a mercenary captain or something. See, that gave us a little bit of gold, not a, not a ton. But yeah, if thinking about that, if we're looking at our character screen, oh, stewardship, I need to level that up. Um, influence or taxes. And when we're landed, we're not going to have issues with money. I think we're going to have issues with influence. So we'll get a little bit more influence. If ruler of our clan. And I think our clan is actually almost set up. Um, sorry, Dwayne. We don't have enough for you. Can I do some trading? Uh, yes, I can. Actually, I can sell that clay for a decent turnaround. Right? Did I make money there? I think I made money. Not very much if I did. But we definitely have enough. No, we don't actually have enough. I th did we lose money there? We must have lost money due to the caravan. So we're going to have to support that caravan, which means we're going to have to... I don't know what we're going to do. How are we doing on the journal? How many days? We need to do one more day and then we can get that reward done. Do I want to try and do a little trade? We could take our dates and try and run over to like... Oh, that place produces dates as well. Oh wow, they've taken this whole... Vampire is invading. I think... I'm just gonna wait. And we'll just wait for that quest to be ready for us to move on to the next part. Um, actually, hold on. I have some prisoners. Yeah, we're just gonna... Yeah, we're, we're get, still losing the money from that caravan. Hopefully it starts making some money. Rudan, I'm sorry. I, I, I said I was gonna wait, but then we started losing more. So we'll just... We'll, we'll go a little bit more hunting on these guys. I'm not gonna actually do the combat on this. I'm just gonna send in my troops and see what happens. Good. And good. I mean, it's not that great, but it's it's something. It gives us something to do while we're waiting for that quest. Uh, we'll, I like how you can ransom the prisoners though, like quicker though. Like that's pretty pretty good. Uh, and then there is a Falky on there. Is that better than my blade? No, it's like comparable tier three. I like how they give you the weapon tiers. That that helps me quite a bit, actually. See, now we're we got some cash. Got a good amount of cash, actually. Oh, I got butter as well. Sell the butter. Sorry, butter lords. Is that are they ready for me? That was two days ago. It should be any minute that that quest is ready for us, right? Medicine skill increased. Okay, now that has to be ready. No, it's not. Okay, we'll wait just a little bit longer. I think it will tell me when it's ready, actually. I just don't want to lose my daily wages. There we go. I'm pretty sure that's it. Rival gang. Okay, so if we go here... Please don't bug out on me. I don't want to have to fail another quest. It looks like it might be... The same layout. Nope. Okay, it actually worked this time. Give my word. Uh, Crush Finger Hara Tharik. I gave my word. That watchman got me. Got the other watchman though. There we go. Nice. I did really good in that combat actually. Oh my god. Got quite a few kills. I think I'm getting a hang of it. I spent a little bit of time in the arena actually as well in between battles. Or in between episodes. 
Man, that was actually exhilarating. My heart got going there a little. <laughs> good old Banner Lord. It feels weird saying good old Banner Lord. Okay. Therik likes me quite a bit. Crush finger, sorry. Okay, so that probably means that we have enough gold now to buy your your fenced goods. And then we can sell said fenced goods. Yes, I'll take those. And I'll leave. That guy will be like, oh, please don't do it. And then I'll be like, yeah, chill out. This is none of your business, merchant. Yeah. Galzala does not like me. Is that the same person that didn't like me from before? I think it is. Um, so if I leave, okay, then I get, I, you have to actually leave to get the items. It's kind of weird. So I think I just got the jewelry there. Ooh, nice. Okay. Let's trade some of that jewelry. I don't think I'm going to trade all of it because it depreciates in value. Actually, no, we'll, we'll trade all of it. Oh, and there's some grapes here. We could sell, or I don't, we just have one unit of grapes. That was kind of random. Um, I will sell some of the grain, though. Because it's uh, actually worth more than it usually is. And then I think that that should allow us to get that iron ore that we needed for this other quest. Was it five units, he said? I think it was five units. It might be six. I feel like it's six. Six, yes. <laughs> Sorry, that was my bad. There should be like a T for trade or something like that. So it just makes it a little bit quicker in that menu. I'm, I'm so used to um, Star Sector where you can do that. Where like there's like a one, two, all of these things, it's like one, two, three, four, five, six. So if you know the numbers, you can just go through the menus super quick. Kind of like in Caves of Cud, like if you watch me play that game, you see how fast I navigate some stuff. And you could almost macro, get some macro setups for it. All right, here you go. I think I made a small profit there. I leave. Um, I thought, hold on. Didn't I just complete that quest? Six units of iron ore. I thought, I don't I have that in my inventory? I'm pretty sure I have that in my inventory, bro. There we go. So, Dwayne here, he's my ombre. He loves me. Galzala really does not. <laughs> well, we're making friends and enemies. Galzala's gonna really be trying to tell everyone how we're a criminal. Uh, let's let's go ahead and escort this merchant caravan. Yeah, we'll we'll do. We're, this is gonna be like as many quests as possible episode kind of thing. Sure, I'll escort your caravan. I've got my own running, but I'll, it's probably a good idea to befriend you. I'm just going to hang out by the gates and wait for them to leave. Uh, where are you going to? Balktand? Uh, where, where, what did you buy? Grain, dates, oil, salt... Yeah, I mean, that's essentially what I have. I could buy bigger quantities of that. That probably... Uh, a terrible idea. We'll just take this. His lead. We'll buy some similar stuff. Um, the dates are a little, a little expensive here. The oil, I will take. The flax, though. The flax is where it's at. That's where we're going to make some serious money right now. 
Let's just load up on as much flax as I can. We're going to be a bulk trader, which is, by the way, that's really how you make a lot of money in this game, is if you bulk trade um, some stuff, you can make serious cash. Like, kind of crazy. Um... I don't know about the animals because it doesn't tell me when it's a good price. I don't really even keep track of them. Let's just buy a little bit more salt. We'll leave ourselves with a couple days worth of materials and we'll we'll complete this quest. We're kind of pushing it a little tight on our finances, but as far as I can tell, we're pretty safe. Like we haven't really had too many raiders or anything and issues with that. Just kind of zigzag along here, sorry. I have to like click and then press three. Oh, we could get more dates here. Let's see, what's your price on the on the dates this place? Actually, huh. Not the best. Okay. I thought that you'd give me a good deal, fellow Asari, but I guess not. I've always heard that about people from the Middle East. I know it's like totally racist, but like about them like hooking up family and relatives with like really good deals or like helping people get stuff in industries. I suppose everyone does that though, right? Oh, we could sell our grain for quite a bit there. I'm gonna keep most of the grain, but that is, that's a pretty good price for grain. These are desert horses. I might buy some more desert horses and then just sell them as a product in other places. Nope, never mind. That's not happening. Oh, look, they're they're trying to siege this castle back. That's cool. Yeah, I hope you guys win. Um, it looks like you're not going to, though. They're not sieging. They're just getting crushed, actually. My bad. It looks a little similar sometimes. Okay, let's just kill these looters really quick. I'm not even going to fight it myself. We'll just do like we did last time. I was like, wait, retreat? What? Why am I getting that menu? Are you gonna go to this city right here? Man, it's taking a while for that thing to get a profit. Oh, by the way, I think... Yeah, he's still traveling. Can I make you, like, the economist or anything? Or a scout? Oh, I can give rules? What if I give myself... Um, I would probably want, I don't know, Quartermaster for myself? And you, what are you skilled at? Essentially just fighting. Maybe I should make you the Quartermaster. Yeah, because you're not going to, you could be like the Scout, so you're maybe extra fast, I don't know. Now I'll be the Surgeon, because I've put myself back together a couple times. Are you going to Damascus? Please tell me you're going to Damascus. Oh no. Oh god. Do we have a pathing bug? Oh no, you're running away from someone. Oro's party. Oh, I see. Okay, good. Well, I, I'm glad it's not a bug. And that you're just tripping out over that party. Um, do we fight them? They're probably way better troops than us. Trained infantrymen. I'm looking at Maya guys. Oh, jeez. Why have I not been seeing messages about these guys being ready to upgrade? I don't have enough to pay for them all. Be upgraded. Hold on. I'm over my troop limit. Oh, I've got five wounded and 20. I can only have 20 people. Um, see ya, thug. Yeah, I think that's probably the better move. And we're out, we're out of money. Okay. Well, 
we're about to fail this quest if we don't get involved. The uh, question is, is that worth it? These guys are just like armed traders and tribesmen against Turidos' party. Yeah, I... A number of them are wounded. There's enough of them wounded to make me think that we might have a chance. If I had upgraded troops, I'd feel a lot more comfortable with it. But I don't think we do. Oh, they got away. Nice. Alright, so we're just like in enemy territory right now, so you're just gonna probably be a bugged out mess. Yeah, this is gonna be really annoying. Hopefully, oh, party lost morale. Can I trade myself then? Yeah, this is this is kind of annoying right now. What's going on with this? I'm just kind of stuck. Um, oh, look at that. That's that's a good profit. We should have just done this, and then the flax is selling for a good amount here. See what I mean? We got cash money all of a sudden. Um. I mean, not a ton of cash money, but we got enough to upgrade people. And that's really all I, I, I want right now, is the ability to upgrade troops and then maybe attack one of these Imperial forces if uh, this caravan won't move. Yeah, this is... This is pretty frustrating. Yeah, I would love to, but this uh, this quest may never end. By the looks of it, that's the way it's going, at least. I could buy some sheep here. Let's see, what's the price on sheep? Because I was looking at like prices of 90 earlier. Uh, let's get some sheep. Sure. I gotta spend a ton on it because we don't have a ton of money right now. Where are you going to? You kind of got past that part. I'm I'm proud of you. I'll just kind of hang out behind you. I've found that if I hit three and then just kind of wait and stay close to them, that helps. Man, this caravan, we were having some issues making it actually profitable. If I look at the clan screen... Oh, you're going to Hubyar? Total income... Oh, so they actually have made a little bit of money. I think we're not making a whole lot because he's not really a trader. Oh, there's some hardwood here. What's the price on it? I'll, I'll take some of that. And hopefully this merchant takes us to some place where we can actually uh, upload some of this, as well as our dates and whatnot. Uh, those looters are mine. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Wrong force. Let's just say that. And then we're done. Okay. Um, I'm not going to take those prisoners. I'm just going to take your stuff. Oh, was that? Those are just looters, yeah. Looks like a pretty big group of them, though. I'm just glad that we're moving, to be honest. It's good to be out of that little war zone that we were in earlier. Oh, daily change of negative 24. That means that they're starting to make an actual uh, amount of money. Nice, good. Trying to pay off a little. We should... Uh, I think he might be increasing his trading skill. I'm pretty sure that that's how it works. And then, so he's going to get better deals as he goes through it. And I wonder if that means that I get better deals or... I don't know. I don't know how that works. You guys can upgrade more. I really wish the game would tell me that automatically. Yeah. 
Okay, we are almost, 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 almost to the first settlement on this quest, which is insane. There's a settlement right there. Why are you going all the way over here? There better be a serious profit to be made where we're going. I couldn't pay all of our wages? That doesn't make sense. We just got money. We got actually a lot of money. Oh, step bandits? Do they have archers? And they're patrolling around a hideout. Oh, so there's a hideout over there. So we could go, uh, go hunt them down. Are you going to attack the trade caravan? If you do, then I'm here. I sh we should stay with the trade caravan, though. I am making note of that hideout for sure. So yeah, this looks like this is the first of your destinations. So guess what? I'm going to undercut you. <laughs> Because that's how we do it here. Um, let's see, yes. We're going to undercut, but not by much by the looks of it. Um, I think we're making a decent profit there, so I'll get rid of it a little bit there. Didn't make a whole lot, though. I kind of want to play their game. Let's just go with the merchant, though. Wait, what? What? Hold on, hold on. What? There's bandits right here. Yeah, I think I should probably um, end this here and we'll start the next one with this battle. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.